Hello, this is Derek back with DC Elite Basketball. Today we're going to talk about an option instead of a spin move to get out of single coverage or a trap. Okay, we're going to talk about the quarter turn today and break it down a little bit to help you get out of again a trap or any kind of situation where you're in a tight space. So as you see, I have two chairs right here. I'll use this with my athletes I train or with the teams I coach for basketball. And what we're looking to do is once you dribble in and a trap approaches you, you got to find a way to get out. So the first main goal is to get spacing and get away from the defenders, okay? Once you're away from the defenders or creating space, you have options. Uh, you could cross over, you could take off this way, but they might cut you off. And also you could do a spin move here and sort of roll out. But my favorite move is to do a quarter turn. Now a quarter turn is basically you're faking a spin move and coming back the same direction you just came from. So instead of going all the way out into a spin move, you're gonna quarter turn and explode to the direction to your right. Or if he's going to your left, you go to your left. Now, with this drill, once you get your spacing, the biggest key is getting the ball behind you to dribble, which is gonna punch you out of that pocket. So if you dribble here and just step back and go, that's not ex explosive and the defender isn't gonna fall for it very easy. So if you just go, that's not really doing much. You gotta be able to bring this ball back behind your body, punch it or pound dribble, which is gonna give you momentum to kick out of this move. Now if you watch my footwork without the ball, it's gonna look like this. You'll come back, lift this leg up, and push off. So you're almost splitting your feet in order to push away. So to break it down a little bit quicker, you'll come in, come back, punch out. Now if you get behind me, once you get behind me here, and sort of see it from the side and the back, you're gonna see the ball a little better even. Again, you're trying to get the ball from here to behind you. You're going to drill the ball behind you in order to punch out quick. Okay. In your body, you're trying to turn your head and shoulders like you're going to do a spin move that bounces the ball at the same time. That's going to sell you going to a spin move, but you're really coming back the other direction. So to start from the very basic, if you've never done this move, you can just start with doing a front dribble in the middle of your body and to the side. And get used to drilling the ball on the back side of your foot. Then you're gonna start exaggerating a head turn and shoulder turn like you're going to do a spin move. Now if you see when I do this back dribble, I'm really getting down and loading up to sell a spin move, but I'm loading up so I can load this leg up to punch out quicker actually. Once you've done that a few reps and get comfortable with it, now just take a step forward and get a feel for what that feels like. So forward, then you add your head and shoulders and turn, okay? It might take you a few reps to get it, and you might even want to record yourself on your cell phone or camera or have a friend watch you and make sure you're doing it pretty close. All right, so to see that full speed is going to sort of look like this. I'm going to dribble in, back, and you can do it the other way. We'll come in, space. And you can do this move virtually anywhere you want on the court. You could do it driving to the post, come back re-attack, whatever you want to do. Uh, so that's pretty much it. The quarter turn is a good alternative for a spin move. You can load up, explode out quickly to your shot, to a pass, or drive the hole. All right, that's Derek with DC League Basketball. Thanks for watching, subscribe. Till next time, keep practicing.